Hello everyone, the Senpai Code here. So I recently did a video for the adventure action game that I'm making and I just want to put this into a separate video so that everyone who just wants to learn how to turn a deaf sound on or to cut the music from their level music or whatever music they have playing their world music and to play the deaf music. So let's get into this. So what you're going to do is this is going to be into C sharp script so this right click Go create and then create a C sharp script. And then name it sound effects, like I have done right here. So, this is going to be the script that you're going to be using. So, once you have the script open, go ahead and just type out public audio source level music, public audio source death song. And this is where we're going to be dropping our game objects into. And then we're going to have a public bool level song equals true. This will be what we're going to be calling the level song. Uh, to turn on and off with and then the public pool death song equals false and this is what we're going to be turning the death song or the death music when we do the GUI on and off with. So there's nothing going to be in the void start or void update but you're going to create a public void level music and then level music you want to say level song equals true like what we have here and death song equals false level music dot play. So it's going to be playing the level music right here through the game object that we're going to be dragging in there. You're then going to create another public void and name it death sound. And this will be your death music. And this is what's going to be turning off the level music and then playing the death song. So if level music dot is playing, so if the level music is playing, level song equals false, which is right here. And that's going to turn this to false, so it's going to turn the bool off. And then you're going to put in brackets right here, level music dot stop. So it's going to stop the level music. And then you're going to put if exclamation mark def song dot is playing and def song equals false, then def song play. So play the def song if it's not playing. So it's this is if it's not playing play it and then death song equals true and so it's turning on this switch right here so what you're going to do is you're going to create another game object and you're going to create a another audio source so go game object create empty name it game over music and then add an audio source to it so audio source add one and then drag and drop your audio so your game over into the game over audio and then you have your level music your game object to your level music the audio source which you just drag and drop into also and then for the audio source for my level I have it on play on the wake and loop so it will just loop over and it will just play once the game starts and then lastly you want to create a game object go create empty and just name it music player and this is what we're going to be detaching our script onto. So our sound effects, let's drag and drop that in. You don't need to add a sound audio source to it. That's what uh, the game objects are for. So you're going to take the level music game object and drop it in. You're going to take your death song or death music and put that in there. Level song should be true, death song should be false. And this is where you're going to be able to tell if there's a problem. So when you hit play, your level music is should be starting like it is now and when you die so I have a health script on here and I'll show you guys how to link the script here in a second so when I die my death sound is playing the laughing and the game over and death song is on and level song is off and when I hit resume the, the level music will restart this is off and the level song is on. So for your scripts, I'm not sure how you guys are running your health scripts or anything like that. Uh, if you guys have just came here to find out how to actually stop uh, music and playing. But how I did mine is I have a player health script. And when it gets to the dead is dead, it's going to activate the sound effect death sound. So find object of type, the script, sound effects that we just created, and it's going to play death sound. 
So it's going to stop the music and do that when my character dies. So I do have a bool here and it's turning the bool on and off. So it's true, death is true. And then I also do have it do another stuff, the camera. And then I do have for the continue the game over menu. Uh, I do have when they hit respawn, I do have everything going on and it goes to sound effects, level music, sound effects, level music, and then it's throwing level music is true, that song is false, and then it plays the music. And that's how I have this so far going. Anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, leave a like, comment down below, and I'll see you guys later. You're breaking it down. It's